Look, man, if you're going to go out, if you're going to lose, at least go out kicking and screaming. He knows it's he knows the jig is up. He knows he's lost. And this is just the realization set settling in. It's over. It's over. So what this is is what is Trump going to do? Are they gonna get some army dudes to physically lubricate him and shove him out of the White House physically, which would be hilarious. It would, I would pay with my blood. I would pay with my blood and my kidneys to see the military army physically have to remove him, shove him in a helicopter and, and take him to Siberia or to Scornthorpe. That would be hilarious. This is, it's entertaining. This is, this is better than Inception. This is better than The Godfather. This is better than Shawshank Redemption, okay? Because... It's like, <laughs> he just doesn't want to go. Because my thing is this, that I'm confused. On one hand, is it a case where Trump is like, yeah, I've lost. I know I've lost. But I want people to remember me. And I want to go away kicking and screaming, say fraud, it's bad, and so forth, and, and, and everything, just to put up if it falls to us. Because I don't want to show that I really lost, but there is doubt as to how I lost you know, I want to just put that doubt in there. But yeah, I know I'm lost, but I will not go away quietly. That's on one hand. But on the other hand is he does, he refuses to accept that he's lost and he does believe that he has won. And even if it is shown that the votes of go to Biden, he will say, no, I don't believe it. Because I'm not sure. The difficulty here is that I'm not sure because I don't know whether it's a case of Trump wanting this presidency i really believe that he didn't think he was going to win against hillary he just wanted just to put his name and his brand out, 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 out there but after he won he was like oh snap i think after this four years he's loved the power which is why and this is what i was saying to my brother on the phone call why is was his trump tweet how did trump use his personal twitter account to tweet why not the white house twitter twitter, twitter, twitter account because after you leave office, the, that's White House Twitter account goes to the next president. But by Trump using his personal Twitter account, it means that when he leaves, he takes all those followers with him. <laughs> so all those dudes, they all come with him if he if he uses his personal Twitter during his presidency, which gives his brand and his um, and just and just puts him under a greater magnifying. Uh, basically, he it puts him. It's, 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 it puts a magnifying glass on him. It gives him greater exposure as the president. Far greater than being a millionaire when he was a private citizen. But this is fascinating. No, this is amazing. I don't care what anyone says. This is exciting. Like, this is hilarious. I mean, wait, who's this? I think this is even my, my brother. Even, who's this? <laughs> Basically, this is my... Brother just sent me a message saying that Donald Jr. just arrived in Georgia. Eric Trump is saying if anybody has sees any fraud, there's a hotline to call Eric Trump. My brother just, just told me Donny Jr. is now in Georgia. The votes are like a 2,000, 5,000. This has lived up to expectation. And I think this is why I was so pumped over this because this is exciting. Because only America can deliver something this exciting. Only America, only specifically Trump, can deliver something like, like this. But just looking at that Trump speech, he knows. He, so right now, you see, what, this is what I want. Because they say by Saturday or Sunday, I want all the votes tab, um, tabulated. Once they're all counted, most likely they'll go to Biden. Once it's now official, what happens? Is Trump going to be like, nope, we're dragging this to the courts? Because <laughs> Homeboy said, 
We're taking this to the highest court. So we're dragging this to the Supreme Court. So how far is he, is he going to take this? Trump wants people, for better or for worse, to remember his 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 presidency. Say he can be like, you can say what you want, say whatever you want. You will remember my presidency. You are going to remember who your boy was. And let's keep it real. Whether you loved him or whether you hated him, Trump has etched his name in history. It is what it is. Even if you despised him, it's like flipping, um, it's like Idi Amin or um, Genghis Khan or Hitler. These guys have etched their name in history for better or for worse. Obviously, for worse based on what they did. You know? So for Trump, in this, for his four years, what he's done in his four years, his base, his supporters, and what he's doing, the fact that he won his four years, him, what he did with North Korea, and now what he's doing. Because I really see this one here. Yeah, because I've been thinking about this. Does Trump still want to be president? Does he not want to be president? Does he? But the more and more I think about it, Trump wants really wants another four years because he likes the power. And the kind of power he has, the kind of love he receives from his supporters, the kind of love that he receives, and the kind of power that he has with those tweets he he, he 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 never had that all through the years as being a millionaire or billionaire or, or whatsoever speaking of twitter you know if you go on trump's um and see if you go on trump's twitter feed all you see is like basically you can't actually read anything because everything has been flagged by by twitter so basically jack has been like bro flag 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 because it's like fraud 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 <sighs> How do this? This is how I think it's going to end. This is just my prediction of how I think it's, it's, it's going to end. Biden will win based on the votes. Trump will. Trump will attempt to take this to the courts. See, this is where I now need like to speak to like a lawyer. You know, and to see, okay, what can... See, but here's the thing. If Biden has won and the votes are tabulated, he isn't officially president until January because you're not officially president until you're sworn in. So Trump still has the power of the president until Biden is sworn in. So Trump is going to use everything within his power so he'll get laws, read books, use everything within his power to hold on to, to, to hold on to that seat as president because he's still president from now until January when Biden is sworn, sworn in. So, so, the, so the question is, how much power does he have as, as president to overturn what homeboy has, to overturn the result of the votes? This is exciting, bro. Guys, <laughs> I don't give you that. This is exciting. Remember to like the vid. Remember to sub, 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 subscribe, man, for that content crap, man. Peace out. Stay true. And stay real.